Coach Bacalar, I know it was uh, kind of a tough loss, but uh, how did how was it getting back out there after a year and a half? I mean, it's just phenomenal. It's a beautiful day. So happy to be out here. Be Beachwood's got a great facility. Uh, you know, Coach Andy, he's a he's a good guy. They run a great program. Uh, he does things the right way. So of course, you know, it didn't go the way we wanted to, but just happy to get out here competing and, uh, and playing baseball with our friends and playing baseball with people we respect. Awesome. And you guys, you have a pretty young team out there. I believe no seniors and eight freshmen? Uh, close, close. Uh, no seniors and then uh, we have, I believe, four freshmen, a sophomore, and then uh, juniors. Only 11 players playing this year. We have 12 players playing this year, so very young. Uh, we lost a lot from last season, but really just happy with the way those guys played. You know, we hung in there. Uh, Jake Dustman pitched really well for us. Uh, you know, gave us uh, really five quality innings. It was four to nothing. Kept us in the game. Uh, you know, Beachwood's pitcher 
was a, did a great job tonight. Uh, you know, just threw a ton of strikes, uh, put the pressure on us to swing the bats. But I, li I like the way we played. I think that we definitely showed some glimpses of what we can be. Here with uh, head coach Andy Pohl and uh, senior pitcher Jordan Levin. Talk, uh, tell us how it, how it was to get out there first time in a year and a half. Sure. Uh, I mean, th this group's been waiting a long time. We've been in the gym every day uh, doing our work, so it, it feels great that we finally get to get out here and put it all on the field. You had an outstanding game today. You had, I believe, I had you down for nine strikeouts. Uh, what, what was it that led to you get what your success out there? And you uh, had a couple huge hits there. You knocked in a few runs. Uh, really, my location is, is what gets me through my, my outings. And my catcher, Brendan Malik, did a great job today framing for me and receiving. So we call it a great game today. That's, that's a body of work right there. I mean, Jordan's been around the program for this is fourth year on varsity. Um, he's, a, he's a veteran. He's, he's got the highest baseball IQ of probably anyone I've ever worked with in 20 years in this business. Um, you know, Jordan walks into the facility with a business-like approach. He gets better every day. I think he just saw it out there. He took care of his business, um, plays the game the right way, does everything we ask him to. Um, and again, that was just four years of body of work right there. So really excited about what he did today. I know we're just scratching the surface. Awesome. And uh, how big is this going into CBC play? Because you've got a game Monday against Trinity. Yeah, I mean, we're, just, we're taking one game at a time. You know, I mean, it, it's, you know, we, we played well today, but you're only as good as your, your last at bat and your last game. So, um, you know, we'll, we'll enjoy this one. There's some things we got to do better. You know, we, we struggled in situational hitting, um, and that's something we really got to get better at because that's going to bite us. Um, you know, fortunately for today, pitching by Jordan kind of got us out of, you know, we didn't need all those runs, um, but at some point we're going to need them, and so we got to get better there. But, but no, it's, it, you know, like anything else, it's nice to get that first one out of the way. Um, but, um, you know, we'll enjoy this one. We'll come back humble, you know, on Monday morning and get back, get back to work.